morning to you. I woke up miserable this morning. Didn't get a lot of sleep. I had a headache all night. And um, I do some ibuprofen um, before I went to bed um, for my feet because they were really hurting. And um, I don't know. I just had a headache and it hasn't gone away. It's like right behind my right eyeball. It's not quite a migraine. It doesn't feel like a migraine because um, I had migraines before. But my right eyeball and then my right ear. My right ear feels like clogged. I don't know what's going on. All I know is that the mystery from yesterday has spilled over until today. I know I'll get better because um, at lunchtime my daughter's picking me up and I'll be able to relax at her house, but why? Why? Anyways, oh, my head is like killing me right now and I should have taken some Tylenol this morning, but I took ibuprofen from my feet because they were still hurting. I know, I'm all like beat up to hell right now. Oh. Anywho, can't wait to rest, kind of. You know, I still have to do everything I do um, when I go into town, once I get to my daughter's house. So let's see how much rest I'm gonna get. But um, only going 5.9 today to the area where she's picking us up. Um, once I get to Dunn Cannon, which I should be there in the next like hour and a half or so. Um, we're gonna have some breakfast at a diner. Hopefully they'll make me feel better and perhaps I can take some Tylenol, I don't know. Not feeling so hot today. I don't know what's going on. It's weird, I, it's been a while since I got a headache. I used to get migraines, headaches at work, you know, stress, but this is not stressful. This is the opposite of stressful. Well, I don't know. The heat and the climbs are stressful. Maybe that is it. I don't know. Oh my God, that'll be my luck <laughs> that I get migraines from hiking. Oh, I have to laugh or not. I'm going to cry. But, um, oh. Hopefully, you know, by this afternoon, I'll be feeling better um, and I'll be able to enjoy the half of the 4th of July weekend. Um, yeah. Anywho, um, let's, get, let's continue hiking. I've been hiking for about half an hour or so. Not long. Um, but um, I'm just ready to get to town. Yeah, not feeling too hot. But... We'll make it, because that's our motto. We got this to the end. Um, and not a, head, a headache is not gonna stop me. <laughs> All right, team. Let's get to hiking and enjoy the time off. Oh, this is quite a view. That's the first real view we had since yesterday. Ooh, and I think you can see the river and the stone cannon right there. And I believe that's the Susquehanna River and we cross it at some point. Don't quote me on it. I'm not sure. Oh, God. And no, I am not feeling better. <laughs> I'm just faking it until I make it. Oh, I wonder what that river is down there. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah. Need to look it up. <laughs> It's beautiful. Let's keep on, let's keep on going. Oh, this is a bit overwhelming. It seems like this big rock is holding all that. And I'm standing right under it. I know. Dangerous living. Look at this. That's nuts. And of course, the first thing I think is like, if there's an earthquake, this shit, I'm sorry, language, um, this rocks will just come down like 
crazy downhill. It's very, very steep, by the way. Coming down into Dunn Canyon. Very steep. There's like stairs and stuff. And then, of course, there's this. Oh, I just wanted to show you. Yeah, but that's gnarly. And it just keeps going down and down and down and down. And continues down there. This looked like it happened recently. See, leaves are still green. Oh, dangers. I'm surrounded by dangers. Well, folks, I am in Duncan, Pennsylvania. I'm just going through the center of town. And I'm going to stop by some restaurant. Hopefully it's open. You know, we're going to have some breakfast. Yeah, this is it. Pretty standard for Pennsylvania town. Like I mentioned before, I used to live in Pennsylvania. And a lot of the towns look like this. So I am really excited because the outfitters here in Don Cannon, they got darn tough socks exchange and I'm exchanging my socks because they have friction points you can see right here and I'm going to get new ones for the rest of my hunt. This is very, very exciting so I'm going to exchange both of them. I got new brand new socks. I'm so excited. Now, I'm getting new shoes today. See, big old hole, no thread. So, brand new woman. So I'm waiting here at 3B Ice Cream. We're gonna get some ice cream, even though we just had breakfast. And I just saw this, Clark's Fairy Tavern. I don't know if it's a historic something, but check it out it looks old and anything that might have history I absolutely love oh it is the oldest building in Duncanon it was a docking point for the ferry crossings of Susquehanna River in tavern stay to stop cool I love history. Wow. It's awesome. It doesn't look like it's occupied. It looks like it's empty inside, but neat. Oh, and this is the front. Oh, beautiful. Now let's get some ice cream. I am having a delicious peaches and cream milkshake. Mm. After having cream cheese beef over home fries and rye bread at the diner. Perfect morning. Mm. I am crossing the Juanita River. It's beautiful. It's so big. Now I'm about to cross the Susquehanna River. Juanita was the other one, and this is the Susquehanna River. And right at this point is where both rivers merge. Oh my God, this is unreal. And I'm here.
I'm a little tipsy. Just a little bit? Just a little bit. <laughs> Marina's a little tipsy. <laughs> she is. And best we, margarita ever. I made her the best margarita ever. Water yeah. now. Water now. And now she needs to drink water. Yeah. I guess Tex had deep rub rub off on me a little bit. Wow. Just a little bit. Yeah. I'm at a sushi restaurant and I'm having dumplings. And I don't know what that is, but beef no 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 no. Yeah. <laughs> That's what Marina ordered and I'm gonna try one. Because yeah. they look interesting. And then we're gonna have tons of sushi. I just had sushi in Crisona and it was really, really good. Let me show you a little bit about this town. Oh, this diner right here is really good, by the way. I've eaten there a couple times already. Not today, but from the times that I have visited before. 